there's a pin here, wrist pin, and as you can see that, see if we can't rotate that wrist pin. See if we can't get in there with the needle nose. Yeah, and pull it out just like that. Press this guy out. Yep, it just falls straight out. And uh, there he goes. Wow, just fell right out. You only have to take one of them out. Denatured alcohol. I'm not worried about that. Get that varnish off, wire brush. A little bit better. The thin rings go on the bottom. Probably should have put those in first, but uh, I'm not going to worry about it. I may go fishing, man, because working on this motor get, tries my patience. <laughs> I know people talk, oh, that's half the fun, putting it together. Dude, I'd rather be running. I'd rather be fishing. A whole lot of people keep asking me about these motors, and so I figure why not go ahead and the bottom set of rings. So it's sandwiched, you know, thin ring, the little wafer spring-like ring, and then another super thin ring. Ah, there we go. We got it. And we'll put this top middle ring here on here, put the top ring on. And the other gap's there. So it's, we got everything at about 180 degrees apart. Remember, we molly lube this guy. And that slips in there pretty well that okay now there's an arrow here I'm not really exactly sure what that arrow is for but I'm assuming that it's pointing toward the cylinder head and that's where I'm gonna orient it I didn't make note of where it should be these wrist pins are what hold this thing together these are a dollar fifty a piece from OMB it, they come in pairs, $1.50 a piece, so like 75 cents each, I suppose. I recommend you just buy four or five of them because you're going to lose them. I mean, these are, I call them G clips because they look like a letter G. Easier to get it in and out. So that's already in there. And the only thing we need to do is just make it click. Yep, you heard it. Did you hear that click? That's all you need to do. And see, the original here doesn't have that G in it. That makes it easy to get out. So I think what we're going to do is go ahead and Replace this other one as well. The old old clip, new clip. Same thing, we just put that in there and just, just make sure it's seated in there well all around the, in there. Instead of trying to get that little groove and trying to get these needle nose probably in that little grip, you can just come right there in the middle of the wrist pin and pull it straight out, just bam, it'll pull right out. Okay guys, so remember, OMB Warehouse are the ones who chipped in to make this possible, along with some of the contri contributions from you guys. But OMB chipped in $318 worth of parts to make this build happen. If you want to know what the part numbers are, check the description below, because it depends on whether you have the Hemi series or the non-Hemi series of the 212 Predator, depends on what part you get. That's why I'm not trying to give out part numbers during the video. So check them out. You can buy it from there. Tell them Damon sent you or tell them that you got heard about it from Black Warrior Lures. And that helps us out because we're trying to build a relationship there. All right. Uh, I will talk to you guys later.